What is up everybody, Justic here, and today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to make your voice sound like a robot in Audacity. Let's get into it. All right, so the first thing you need is some audio, so just go ahead and record your audio. I'm just gonna record a quick little example right here. Self-destruct in three, two, one. All right, there we go, if that's the audio, let's play it back. Self-destruct in three, two, one. All right, so we got an, uh, an Australian robot coming up, ready? All right, so we're gonna have an Australian robot. So just go ahead and delete the excess parts of the audio. So, bang, so it just starts straight away and finishes straight away. One. All right, that sounds good. So we're gonna go ahead and select this. Do we have any? Two. Not really any background noise, but we're just gonna do it just in case. I've got a tutorial on this, but I'm just gonna quickly do it just so um, it sounds good. You can go and go ahead and check that tutorial out. Um, there'll be a card in the top right corner. So the first thing you wanna do is copy the track. Then after you copied it, go tracks, add new. Then go stereo track. And then you wanna press, once you've copied it, press control V. That's copied in here. Then you're gonna go ahead and select this track. All right, then we go to effect, go to echo, and then change the delay time to 0.04 or 0. Between 0 0.04 and 0 0.1, anytime in between there. Change the delay pack factor to 0 0.6. Preview. Self-destruct in three. All right, that, sound, that sounds all right. Press OK. Then next, what we want to do is change the pitch. So just go effect, go change pitch. And then that's a bit too much. So it's going to go negative, ooh, negative 20. Let's preview that. Self-destruct in three, two, one. All right, it's getting there, it's getting there. All right, so after this, we need to make another track. So go ahead and, and select um, the first track, because it's normal, and press Control C, then go Tracks, Add New, Stereo Track, oh, Jesus. Then you wanna go ahead and paste it in there. It's nice and pasted, and go ahead and select it. I, didn't, oh, I was already selected. And then go to Effect, Change Pitch, and this time, you wanna set the pitch to just 20, because then we'll have, um, Conflicting pitches and it will sound better. Self destruct in three, two. Alright, that's how that sounds, but listen to how it sounds all together. Self destruct in three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I reckon this one is a bit too a bit too deep. So we're gonna go ahead and change the pitch again. Alright, so the first the first bit of audio sounds sounds a bit too um bit too normal. So what we're gonna do is select this. Go to effect, and we're just gonna add a little bit of echo to this one. All right, let's see how that sounds. All right, so I reckon this sounds pretty good. Let's go ahead and play it back for you. Self-destruct in three, two, one. All right, and there you go. That is how you make a robo voice. Um, you guys can play around the settings to your liking. This is just how I like it. So um, those settings that I suggested in the video um, are not the only way you can get a robot sounding voice. So just play around with it, see what you like. But um, if you want to sound like, like how I like it, um, follow the tutorial step for step. Um, that is it from me, guys. If this video did help you, please hit the like button. And if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button as well. And if you have any problems, please leave a comment down below. I'll try and get to all of you, but it is a bit hard because I get a lot of comments. But I will try. Anyway, guys, that is it from me. Have a wonderful day. And peace out.